All right, so we're gonna go over a big time mobility exercise um, for your shoulders and upper upper body in general, kind of the thoracic spine area. Um, one of the best ways to do your mobility drills is to combine as many as possible into one. That way it's time efficient and it's kind of the best bang for your buck. Um, so what we're gonna do is go over a combination um, mobility drill for your shoulders and your thoracic spine. We're gonna use the foam roller uh, for a support, so that way, um, you don't hurt your back or anything like that when we're doing this. And I'll show you a couple different manipulations that we can go through as we go through all these exercises that we're going to combine together. So the foam roller again, it's just simply to act for support. You're going to lie down on the mat, you're going to lie on your back, and then you're going to bring your top leg over. And now if that right there, if you don't have the mobility in your lower body, kind of bring that over and get to a point where you can do this efficiently without pulling like your whole body over with you, or if it's not like a huge strain, you can continue doing that. Otherwise, you can use other tools if you don't have a foam roller. You can grab like a big medicine ball. And that gives you a little bit more leverage so that you can go up that way, okay? Or you can actually use like a little stack or a little box that we have over here. Um, you just have a 12 inch one, you can actually set that up and kind of lie on the side that way too. Finally, if you don't have any of those things, you can also bend your knees up. Okay? And now you kind of have support through your lower back um, as you do that and you go through here. Now, to get to the actual exercises, like I said before, we want to combine them so you get the best bang for your buck. And just showing you what you can do uh, without any tools. You're going to lie here. And this arm, your bottom arm is going to kind of act as a pillow for your head to support you. You can do a shoulder sweep. So you're going to reach across, extend, Go up, your eyes follow your hand, you turn your hand over at the top, come through, hand goes over, extend, up, and through, okay? Now, you can also use that foam roller, you kind of do that same thing, and have your hands off to the side here, reach over, extend, okay? So now that I have that support here, sweep through, and come back around. So it's a shoulder sweep with a little pec stretch here, a little thoracic spine extension and stretch through here, and you kind of close the book as you come back over, okay? That's the first part of the exercise. Then you can go in and look up towards the ceiling, and now you're gonna work on internal and external rotation of your shoulder. So you're gonna face towards the ceiling, this far hand, your opposite hand will come down. That's an external rotation, and you'll come up. You'll feel a big stretch right there, uh, sorry, this is internal rotation, external, and you're going to go through six reps on that side. This is a big bang for your buck. You can go through six reps through the shoulder sweep and open book, right into an internal external rotation exercise, and then boom, you can flip the foam roller over, go to the other side, and start the same exercise all the way through, and then go through your external and internal rotation. So you get a big bang for your buck for your shoulder health, you get a lot more mobility in your shoulders and your thoracic spine. You should feel a noticeable difference right away. I would say just doing a couple sets of those. Um, a day is fine, otherwise a pre-warm, just get a set in and then you're off to the next mobility drill.